You know, with your electronics, there's so much that you can do and so much that you can know. And, and I set it up with four windows. And the reason I like four windows is it shows me where I am in the lake. So I can, I'm on the wrong, let's go right here. I can zoom in and if I see something I like on the screen, I can punch waypoint and go right back to it. So I got a map of the lake, then I have my sonar. Now my sonar is what I'm used to. That's what I've used my whole entire life out there fishing. So I'm very used to this screen. This is down scan. So it's the same image except with new technology. And what it does is when you go across a school of shad, it breaks them up into individual fish. Where I go across the school of shad on this, it'll look a lot like this. This is prop wash. I'm following behind another boat. So that's prop wash, but it'll be a wad of this yellow, you know, yellow red. Well, here it'll show it to me and go, oh, that's a whole bunch of little bait fish. So you'll see that. And so I'm, I'm comparing these two, and then I've got structure scan that picks up anything outside. So whether it's you know, way out, I, I'm on a 60 foot scale right now, and you can see some of the, the fish right here, those carp, you can see some, some stuff right there. That's, that's uh, probably something really minor on the bottom, like a little bit harder, because usually harder structure comes in lighter colored. Um, so let's just go along here and see if we can find something as we go along. Uh, that I can really show you some cool stuff about structure scan. But remember, the farther you zoom this out, so if I went on 80 feet, then it looks, each piece of structure looks smaller because it's on a bigger scale. And um, so now you can see how it gets lighter. You can see I'm getting shallower. That means I'm getting a little harder bottom, shallower, and it's getting lighter. So that all fits perfectly together with structure scan. And you'll see little things like right here, is a it looks like a little stump right there you can see the little dark line behind it that is a shadow so structure scan is like putting a flashlight out there when it hits a rock or a stump then it's going to throw a shadow behind it here bait fish see all the little marks bait fish bait fish combined so i'm still going along here looking here's a log now this is what's cool you find a log like that i can immediately give you the length of that log now I have to be perpendicular to it because what I will do, and let's see, oh, here we go, this is even better. Here is a big concrete structure. See it right here and I'll just stop. So I can put my cursor on that structure, right on it. I'm gonna zoom in twice. So I put my, my cursor right there and it says it's 20 feet from the boat and I put it on this side and it says it's 28 feet. So it's eight feet long from there to there is eight feet. So that's an eight foot long concrete box. So I can tell that real quick by looking at a piece of structure and going, hey, let me measure it, let me look at it, simple thing. I can pick out my fish, I can pick out my schools of shad, I can pick out my structure, I know where to throw, when to throw, you can't beat it. Man, love it, big old school of shad. So this is the way I set my unit up. And there's a number of different ways to do it and you can set it up that, that follows your fishing, you know, the way you like to fish. Me, this is perfect, so feel free to set it up. You can put all kinds of different pages in here and, and get things to work for you. That's the way I like it. Right like that gives me all the information from being able to set waypoints, mark spots, go back to it and see everything that I have and determine what it is. I love that four panel screen.